Inventory dies, Hyrak. Or resume. I know not what I shall find below, but I know I must go alone. You are in command of the Spear of a Doom now. Until you return, Artemis. Seeking this Fighting them for days. Progress has been difficult. The prophecies foretell of two ascended races working together to seek out the halls of revelation within the temple. Only with both present will the shrines reveal the means to awaken the slumbering Zelnaga. I've never cared much for prophecy. And yet, despite our history, here we stand together. Perhaps you should start. Let us make for the shrine. Yes? We shall prevail. With honor, I lead. It seems the temple has guardians. I will deal with them. There can be no doubt. Shay, halt! Do you sense that? A great power awakens within this construct. Purity of form. Purity. 
purity of essence. Prove your strength. Make it quick enough. My psionic abilities can mend our wounds. I serve my people. So the constructs hold the keys. Good to know. Let us proceed. With honor, I lead. These devices emit solar energy. We should gather them. Our knowledge is your heritage. There can be no doubt. Look out! Hybrid! Yes? Explain it. The future is ours. Another construct. We'll have to destroy it to open the doorway. There can be no doubt. Together, we are strong. Yes. this chasm. Kerrigan, remain here. I must investigate this. Your queen listens. We shall prevail. Dawn will come. Chase is upon us. Kerrigan, the construct is coming for you. Our destiny awaits. Together, we are... Make it quick. We shall prevail. Dawn will Change is upon us. With honor, I lead. A bold plan. Explain yourself. Strength in unity. Together, we are strong. There can be no doubt. Fate is with us. The shrine still functions. Starting to like you, Artanis. Make it quick. Our path is clear. Yes. Explain. Let's finish this. 
our destiny awaits. Our path is clear. Our heritage is your future. Ak and Vyash. Together, we are strong. Shame. Yes? No time. Dawn will come. They're fighting another construct.
yes. Our path is clear. With honor, I have the name. These people are maniacs. Dawn will come. Together, we are strong. What is it? Our destiny. Your queen.
so easily broken, Awa. The firstborn shall fear you no longer! Matriarch, there is a massive output of void energy spiking from the temple below. Target the epicenter. you're released, your blade will not be in my back. You waste time. Lower your blades. I am Alarak, first descendant of the Taldarim. Amon has betrayed my people. Retribution will be claimed for this, and if your hierarch survives, he will aid in it. Make your decision. You will take us to Artanis. Most wise. I have brought an additional defensive ability online, Matriarch. Please visit the Solar Core to configure it. Shall we march? I am 
Dream speaks the truth. Void energies flood from the temple. With each passing moment, the threat grows. I do not trust him, but all data points to the scenario he describes. A gateway to the void has been opened. Is there any way to pinpoint our tennis? No. The energies are making us virtually blind. We must put our faith in this Taldarim. It pains me to do so. Never turn your back on a Taldarim. In fact, if he so much as glares at you, put him down. It will be easier on all of us. Strange. The Keystone is extracting energies at an unprecedented rate. Lead your forces to Artanis. I have done as I promised, Dark Templar. Now go tell your Hierarch. I am waiting for him. Matriarch, our High Templar have volunteered to aid you. The loss of the Kala was not easily borne. But we are ready to serve once again. Templar, I thank you for your bravery in this dire time. We will recover our Hierarch. Your thoughts are clear. I heed the call. Unleash silent storms, brothers. Let these hybrid thralls feel the wrath of the Templar. Charge. Antaro Tassadar. Our power shall serve. I will comply. I have heard of these Terran Spectres. Focus their energies into a feedback loop. They will not bear it. Your thoughts are pure. For art, the darkness will be repelled. To me, my swarm! Templar, join us, quickly! Forazun, your forces have arrived just in time. Amon has opened a portal to the void. It must be shut down before it tears us apart. Agreed. My swarm and I will bear the brunt of Amon's power and buy you time. But it's up to you to seal that portal. 
The gateway draws power from these void crystals. We will need to destroy them if we are to seal the gate. Then it shall be done. The darkness is approaching my hive cluster, Artanis. I hope you're getting ready to disable those crystals. I'll continue sending as many Zerg as I can spare to help you. Fight well, Templar. Hierarch, I am detecting several energy sources hidden across the temple. They appear to be Zel Naga vessels, ancient power sources. If we can locate them, I should be able to use their energy to free up additional solarite from the Spear of Adun's core. We've secured a Zelnaga vessel, Karax. Prepare for transfer. Unbelievable. Despite eons of inactivity, these devices are still at full power. Are showing three more remain, Hierarch.
minions. Move out. Eviscerate any fool who stands in your way. Pressing towards a crystal. If you feel like joining me, don't get in the way. Artanis, hurry up and disable those void crystals. My hive cluster is taking a beating. That's enough. For now. Just 
Citadel is secure. Destroy it as soon as possible. This warrior awakens. From the shadows I come. From the shadows I come. From the shadows I come. This warrior awakens. The darkness rides. I will comply. It is a good day. You have Sorry. not enough minerals. This warrior awakens. You seek out. I bask in the twilight. I play a now. Ready for battle. What would you ask of us? Minions, move out. Eviscerate any fool who stands in your way. Two crystals destroyed. I suspect Amon's forces will not let us take the next two so easily. Hybrid are moving to attack our nexus point. Ready our defenses. Kassar de Templari. Kassar de Templari. From the shadows I come. Source has been secured. I only detect one energy signal left. I bask in the twilight. My hive cluster won't survive much longer. Disable the crystals now. Warrior awakens! What 
Zoom Zoridas. I shall be. My brood is pushing towards a crystal. I thought you'd see it my way. Eyes to the horizon. That is the last of the vessels, Karax. Understood. I am transferring the final power source now. Complete. The skies beckon. This warrior awakens. My minions and I are pushing towards a crystal. Care to join us? Kassad, upgrade complete. From the shadows I come. To become one. Your thoughts are clear. The merging is complete. The merging is complete.
will this day, Kerrigan. Join us. Together, we can defeat Amon and send him back into the void. My swarm was broken here, Artanis. I'll need time to rebuild my forces. There is no time. My people are being consumed. Their very flesh turned into Amon's own. I cannot wait. Then you must do as I have. Gather allies, subjugate enemies, do whatever you can to ensure victory. Survival is never pretty. We are very different leaders, but I thank you nonetheless. Until we meet again. survival, Alarak. What is the true reason you've come to me? Our god broke his ancient covenant and cast us low. These are lies, Artanis! I am the liar. Are you not but a lie incarnate machine? Prototh. Speak your peace, Alarak. The Taldarim's death fleet amasses its slain awaiting the start of a full-scale invasion. I come with an offer. You will aid me in invoking a challenge for the right to rule my kind as High Lord. And in return, I will grant you a cessation of hostilities between our people. Phoenix, rally my advisors. It appears we have much to discuss. Ah, Artanis. I believe I will serve you more effectively from here. Besides, I would rather Alarak remain where he can be watched. Nothing was as it seemed. We came to Almar to awaken the Zelnaga and receive their aid. Instead, Amon nearly killed us. I fear Zeratul's prophecy is no longer clear to me. He was closer to the truth than I thought. The Zelnaga did rest here. Had they lived, I think they would have given us their aid, just as Zeratul said. If nothing else, I will grant him that. Matriarch, your words surprise me. Perhaps your council has proved influential in some regards. Then I will endeavor to give you more of it. I've said some regards, Hierarch. Not all. Rohana. Do you not see why you must sever your nerve cords? I cannot allow you to fall under Amon's sway again. The collar was created in our darkest moment. Only its light was able to bind our people to give us unity. We are born into it, and when we die, our spirits become one with it. It is worth fighting for. And now Amon uses it against us. It sustains his existence. Its time must end. Artanis, through the Kala, our every thought and emotion are made as one. I feel his thoughts and emotions swirling like a vortex throughout. He does not realize it, but here, within the Kala, he is vulnerable. How? Just as he can see into me, I can see into him. We can use this to our advantage, Hierarch. I know it. It is not worth it. Please, I only ask for time. Powerful psionic warriors have joined our ranks, Hierarch. You must choose among them. Cassar de Templari.
have found a way to save our people. As Zeratul foresaw, this keystone can indeed be our salvation. Explain yourself. As we have seen, the keystone was designed to be found and assembled by those who would ascend to become Zelnaga. After leading them to Ulnar, it would also expel its stored energy to awaken the slumbering Zelnaga. The keystone siphons energies and redistributes essence, matter, information, consciousness. To this device, they are all the same. I see that now. This is how it cleansed Kerrigan? It extracted the essence that forged her into the Queen of Blades. Then it used that energy to release Amon from the Void. If I can discover how to control the Keystone, we could use it to extract Amon from the Kala and save our people. Then Zeratul has led us to hope after all. Continue your research, Karax. We have a war to take to Amon. You were right all along, Hierarch. I am little more than a clone of your friend, Phoenix. The Calderim speaks truth. I am synthetic. A replication. A lie. What did you find in the Archive? My death. My rebirth as a Dragoon. And then, my death at the hands of this Queen of Blades. I am not Phoenix, yet I hold his memories as if they were my own. I must have time to consider this. You are a warrior, Phoenix. Whether you identify yourself as my old friend or not, know that I believe in you. And I believe you will help me destroy Amon's armies and save our people. Do not waver because of this knowledge. I will try, Hierarch. such faith in him. Why are you here? Oh, I merely voice the inevitable. I know the true power of what you face. I said destroy you, not I. I have seen enough. His hubris will be his undoing. It is a flaw I also see in you. <laughs> I believe I like you, Hierarch. Your bravery is commendable. Join me then. Together, we can defeat him. I cannot tether my fate to yours. 
Hatred does not burn within you as it does in me. You do not see through the agony of knowing all you believed in is a lie, and that your only solace is found in the destruction of your betrayer. No, Amon corrupted my people, and now turns them into a hybrid abomination. My rage burns brighter than a thousand suns, and soon all will see my wrath unleashed. Then this is something I hope to witness. Has been sealed, but a greater threat looms. Amon is transforming our people into a host form. While we were focused upon Ulnar, he has unleashed the full might of the Golden Armada, using our own weaponry to eradicate life from planets across the Caprulu sector. Our current forces are not powerful enough to engage the Great Fleet. But Amon's other servants run rampant across the sector. Then we should strike immediately. Eliminate his outlying forces. The ancient purifiers were designed for war. If we reactivate them, we can build our armies and destroy Amon's servants in one fell swoop. Assuming they do not turn on us first, the purifiers possess no loyalty, no honor. You waste time bickering. The Taldarim's death fleets are your threat. I alone can challenge Malash for the right to rule and bend his army to my will. Do not forget Mobius Corps. They are rumored to operate from a hidden base where they forge a hybrid army to serve, even now. This is true, but we cannot engage them without knowing where they are. Vorazun, send your most elite Dark Templar to scour the sector. For now, Karax, your focus must remain with the Keystone. The survival of our people depends on our actions in the days to come. It falls to the Firstborn to stop the coming Oblivion. The Zelnaga are dead. There is no salvation within Ulnar. And yet, we indeed found hope. If we are to fight, we must raise an army. Phoenix and I believe that we can awaken the ancient purifiers and call upon their power. They may have been a forbidden weapon, but I have seen their potential in Phoenix and know that this time, they will not fail us. Alarak is indeed a risk. Tassadar, old friend, what would you do? Zeratul, would you have me take such a chance? The answer matters little. If this alliance can weaken Amon's armies, then it is a chance that must be taken. made a decision many of you will not agree with. During my time with Phoenix, I have seen that the Purifier program, under the right guidance, may be reborn. History has shown the Purifiers cannot be controlled, Artemis. They do not have to be. These personalities, like I, will have free will. We do not have enough Purifier matrices to create more like Phoenix. You cannot possibly be considering what I think you are. The original purifiers are housed in orbit above the forest world of Endion, sealed within their warship, Cybros. I have seen through Phoenix that these warriors may be valuable to us. Perhaps the Conclave misunderstood them, treating them as simple robots and not proud Templar. It tried to control them. And they rebelled, attacking their creators. Would you not rebel against a slave master? I have heard your counsel, and I have chosen to go to Endion. 
We leave at once. The purifier stasis grid is still intact. We'll have to destabilize it from the generator below. I'm detecting a massive Zerg infestation on the surface. They can't be Kerrigan's. Amon's brood. This will not be easy. Hierarch, my scouts are tracking the movements of the Golden Armada. What you plan to do is awaken monsters, Artemis. They slaughtered every Templar on the base of Lentinum. They rose against their masters. Our people never treated them as Templar. Because they are robots, created to do the bidding of the Conclave. Is this what you think of Phoenix? A robot whose only purpose is to do your bidding? He certainly defies expectations. He is... more. Perhaps the original Purifier robots will be too. If nothing else, think of their benefit to the war effort. That is, if they choose to join us. I believe in Phoenix. I am willing to take the risk. Alarak's vanguards have joined our cause. It seems our surprises have no end. Cybros with a device called the Megalith. It is the key to disabling the station's stasis lock. Once the grid is down, we have to act swiftly and bring Cybros online or flee orbit. The might of the brood below is too great. Leave the defense to me. I know this will work, Hierarch. I know I can guide the purifiers through the darkness that lies ahead. Help them accept what they are. I can convince them that they will not be treated as servants again. Then it appears as if you have found purpose, brother. Since awakening, I have been confused, directionless, uncertain of what I am. How I came to be, now things are clear once more. Fate has laid out a purpose only I can accomplish. It is exhilarating. Yes, you embark upon a task that even Phoenix could not achieve. Yet he would attempt it if he could. I have learned much from Phoenix's memories, and through them, I have come to know myself. I am Phoenix, but not. I am my own entity. And I take pride in this. 